And then here's another fellow who's just got a really interesting story. I'm not even going to try to tell it. I'm going to let him tell it himself. But John Laney, class of 2000, United States Naval Academy. Uh, welcome, man. And uh, we, we, we heard about Baja, but uh, uh, tell us more. Hey, thanks. Uh, thanks, Jason. So I am, uh, I just retired from the Navy. I just got out uh, about uh, four months ago. And uh, I decided to take a one-year sabbatical. Uh, this is my boy, Thaddeus. Daddy. I've just decided to take a one-year sabbatical uh, with my family down to Baja. And uh, we're, uh, we're taking just a, one year to kind of give back and serve in the community, we've served with some orphan care. Uh, we've served doing some home building, we've done some food distribution. We've done kind of a, something totally different, totally different experience for my boys and, uh, and myself. And, uh, you know, to, to let them know that, hey, there's, there's more out there besides just Targets and Walmarts and Chick-fil-A's and, you know, suburbia, suburbia San Diego, which they grew up in the last, uh, the last four years. So uh, it's, been a, it's been pretty exciting for us. Uh, the other project I'm working on is my website called uh, DOD Reads, uh, which, is, uh, which is we're really trying to corner the market of military readers, military thinkers, military lifelong learners. Um, and the objective is to connect military readers with reading the challenges now. So if you've, uh, if you've got something to say, you've got a book to write or so, uh, let me know and we'll, uh, we'll certainly, uh, certainly talk about getting it promoted and posted up on DOD Reads. Hey, John, on, on your about page, I read the story of the experience that, that led you to found Dodd Reads. Can you tell that story, please? Yeah, I can. So I'm going up before my command board and man, I knew it. Like, I knew it. I had it nailed. I was ready to be the best CEO you ever had. So I walk into the command board and there's, what, four oh sixes, and I knew them all and man, I had this board nailed. My, my command philosophy was down. I knew what I was doing. Very first question. So, John, what are you reading? I did not have a good answer. And I tell you what, Men's Health, Yahoo News, uh, <laughs> and Magazine. <laughs> Don't count. Oh, and naval instructions. Yeah, that doesn't count. What are you reading? And man, I got my I got my tail handed to me. And so the very last thing they said is, "Hey, you're going to be a leader of the next generation. Our finest finest men and women we have to offer. You need to be a reader and a lifelong learner." So I was like, "Okay." A couple weeks later, I drove from DC to San Diego for my next job. It's like, all right, well, I'll try this whole reading thing out. So I downloaded Fahrenheit 451 downloaded Animal Farm, downloaded a philosophy book, a self-help book. And like, who knew? Like there was so much good information in there. Like who knew you could learn so much from a novel? Who knew? Who, like who knew? So I figured that there's another Ensign Laney or JG Laney or Major Laney that could, that could maybe learn from my experience. So that's why that's the impetus for creating DOD Reads. And, and as to the question of whether or not there is such a person Tell us a little bit about your traffic. A traffic on the website? Uh-huh. Okay, so we are on track. So we've got, we got a lot of traffic. We're on track for 100,000 views uh, a month, which a month. on average, <laughs> average would be the eyeballs of every military person. If only military goes, every military person once every 13 months. So if there's 1.3 million military folks, about every month somebody from the military would go to my website. It's kind of a vanity metric, so it's real cool. I, I like getting lots of traffic. Mm -hmm. um, our challenge now, our challenge for 2021 is to take that traffic and those views and to, and to become self-sustainable. We, we got a lot of yeah. traffic, we got a lot of views, but we need to get the income from that so that I can transition this to somebody else and that I don't have to pay for the entire site on my pocket. So we're, we're, I'm, I'm a little surprised that that uh, that, that Amazon, uh, uh, what do you call it, uh, you know the uh, affiliates. You know, we're, we're, yeah, you affiliate. I'm surprised that doesn't do it for you all on its own. Yeah, you know how much I got last month? About five dollars. Five dollars <laughs> yeah. from Amazon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so, we're, so tell me, we're, uh, John, how does it uh, how does it break down your your you know the people who come to see you? Are they are they uh, mostly officers? Mostly enlisted? All yeah, Marine Corps, uh, like, how uh, yeah, does that work? Amazing. Almost, um, probably two thirds of my traffic is from DC. So they are wow. all, so my, my focus area is military professionals. 
Most of them are yeah. Navy. The, the preponderance is Navy. But certainly mm -hmm. Washington, D.C. And, and the Pentagon areas where most of my traffic comes from. So it's Interesting. My, it, my, my core traffic is military professionals. If you're, if you're a military professional, I want your I got your eyeballs. All right. Well, John, I, I want you, I mean, welcome. And I hope we see you soon. But more specifically, I hope you see you in the chair that Sean is sitting in. I, I really want you to come back and, and, and tell tell the story uh, in at length. Um, I, I just Absolutely. think it's an awesome thing that you're doing, man. Yeah, thank you. I had, I had to at least view it first, uh, come yeah. first before I could, uh, before I was comfortable telling. But yeah, let's, uh, yeah. let's get together offline and we'll, we'll talk more about it. Also talk about your sponsors. Absolutely. Absolutely.